Don't worry about it, man. Oh, no, don't do that. Do what? See, he's not gonna tell us anything because he feels too cool that he's got a shot. Yeah, I do have a shot. But you guys wouldn't know about it because I'm fucking low-key, that's why. Low-key, so what are you both a thing now? No, we're not a thing, you know, we're just messing around. Yeah, and Danny over here has got a shot with Julie. What the fuck? Hey, ah. man. All I know is that I'm not spreading any bullshit that ain't true. <laughs> what are you laughing at, huh? You. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <coughs> Look at this. <laughs> oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, so who's the last girl you were talking to, huh? I've been messing around. Really, with who? Like recently? Yeah. Casey Gerwig. <laughs> Oh, oh, dude, are you fucking serious? I was like, no, no get that fucking shit out of here. Oh, Come on. What's did the you, mood? Wait, did you just say you were hooking up with Casey Gerwig? Yeah, and that's that. Don't act all fucking coy. You don't want to share anything about Aaron. I don't want to share anything about Casey. I'm not that impressed. Casey Gerwig's like seven years old, man. Okay, no, she's not. <laughs> seven years old, you're a savage. Fine, a, a freshman, whatever. Sophomore. Oh, so, do you teach her the ways, Nick, or does she? Oh, fuck you. You know what? You want to act as if hooking up with Casey is some kind of joke. You know, that's fine by me, but you're not gonna fucking tell me that her and her group of friends are hotter than the, the girls we graduated with. You know what, I, I, sophomore true. or not? It's kinda true. Fucking sophomore or not, you know they're hotter. Don't f try to tell me otherwise. We okay? graduated, that's fucked up. Huge fucking schlong move. You know what, whatever guys, she's cute and I got proof we talked to. Okay, relax, I don't wanna see Casey Gerwig's weird hand nudes. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Rich. You know, what are you two even talking about anyways? Don't worry about it. Come on, you Don't fuck. worry about it, he says. <laughs> Come on. It's just like small talk about the Yankees. Relax. I want to find out if she's like a real fan or just a poser. You ask her about the team roster and, and she's got to know all of them. <sighs> fuck it. I'm going to leave her hanging. Why would you do that? If you're texting her, don't you want to keep it going? No, he's right. It, it keeps things spicy, you know? Spicy. Spicy. Cumin. You got to do what I'm doing with Erin, but with Julie. You, you just told me to leave her hanging. Just give me your phone and let me text her. You want to fuck her, right? Come on, dude. Just text. Give me the phone. No, no wait. You, you want to help me out? You want to text her? Do you want change in your life? Yeah. Do you want a big change in your life? Are you unhappy with yourself? Uh, yeah, I don't know, man. Say something with me. Say you're the change. I'm the change. Say it again. I'm the change? You want you are? You're gonna make your life better. Wanna why? Why? Say it. Because I'm the change? Bingo! Oh, uh, what the fuck? Give me it back. You're an idiot, that's what you are. Hey, dude, what's your passcode? 5675. Five. Wow, now you're a really big fucking idiot. Why would I say that? Now you're worrying me. Come on. Nothing. Holy Listen. shit! He said I love you! I what the fuck? Yet. Give me my phone, you fucking freak! Steve! Steve! Oh, right here! Get that! Get that! Get that! Get that! That was fucking rough! Danny! Steve! Steve! Pass! <laughs> Come here! It's okay! He's so tired! Grow up! He's so tired! Grow up! <laughs> Relax, I'm not gonna text her that. Hey, stop. Don't be a dick, Steve. Give me my phone. She Come texted on. back. Calm down. What'd she say? Hanging with the girls tonight. That's it? You know what? Take your phone. Like, I'm over here just trying to help out, and you're having a freak out. I didn't even text her anything bad. Want to race? I'm the fastest kid at North High. <laughs> why, why would I race? Why would you say that? Steve, you're a savage. You did track. Rich, look at this. <laughs> what did he say? 
<laughs> you smell like you smell like my mother's nail polish. What the fuck? Why would you say that? Girls like guys who like their mothers. <laughs> you know what? I'm just not gonna text her around you guys. I think better when I'm alone. Why don't you just sprint the lap and then and then text her? No. Okay. Fine. Well, hey man, if that doesn't work out, there'll be a lot of girls in college. Yeah, it'll be a lot less complicated. Oh, I'll tell you, man. Girls like partying, drinking, being complicated, and drinking. We only like two of those things. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> okay, all, all I know is I, I'm really excited for this trip. Oh, fuck, I'm hyped, dude. Word. I can't wait to get the hell out of here. Yeah, no more hanging around this fucking school. Yeah, always hanging around the one place we can't stand. You know what? Fuck this place. Yeah, yeah, fuck this place. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck, fuck you! you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! No, no you're, you're doing it all wrong. You, you gotta, you gotta stand shoulder length apart. Use your left hand to block your face and just straight jabs. You gotta breathe. I'm breathing. You gotta breathe out your mouth. Come on, give me the clothes. <laughs> You've been friends with Steve for how long? You don't know how to throw a punch? Steve always fights for me. Well, he's not gonna be around for much longer. You gotta learn to fight for yourself. I mean, what would you do if you, you, you know, went on a date with a girl and had to suck? And what, I had to fight my date? Very funny. <laughs> Tomorrow morning, you gotta get gear. Tomorrow morning? I thought we were doing that tonight. <sighs> nah, I can't. I'm seeing Lauren tonight. Oh, yeah. How's that going? <sighs> we're just gonna go for it, you know. She's not gonna be in another country. She's just gonna be in a different state. <sighs> we'll see how it goes. Okay, okay, all right, all right, okay, you're, yeah, you're an animal, Richie. Let me see those. You're not worried though, Rich? Uh, Lauren? Yeah. I'm not gonna bust the nut for a couple of months, so that's a bummer. Should be fine, right, it'll be fine. <laughs> hey, um, don't worry about the whole thing with Julie though, I, I figure you're still worried about that. I don't know why I trusted Steve. Oh, God. He's totally I... ruined my chin. Okay. Okay. He was just trying to help you. <laughs> you should be the one talking to her. I know, I know, but what am I supposed to say to her? You guys make it sound so easy. I mean, seriously. Are you ready for this answer? What? She likes you, all right? Just be yourself. <laughs> you're gonna hear it a million times. No, no you're, gonna, you're gonna punch it right or no? Show me what you got, all right? Show me what you got. Okay, easy. Morning, ladies. It's too early for this shit. It's good that we leave early. We'll have more to do. Why are you sitting in the back? He doesn't want me sitting in the front. Whatever, man. You guys go to ANS? Yeah, and one of you guys are buying me lunch. Yo, I'm starving. Eat this. Oh, bacon, egg, and cheese? Nah, it's a BLT. Fucking A. Come on, dude, we said bacon, egg, and cheese. I'm kidding, come on. Rich, you bring ketchup? Forgot. Damn it, Rich. I call shotgun. Uh-uh, that is not happening. Well, I call shotgun. Did you just hear me? I said that's not happening, no shoddy. Bullshit, I call shoddy. Yo, who cares? I do, I always sit in the back. <sighs> Yo, careful, all right? Steve. Relax, I'm just sitting. Yo, put your stuff in the back with our stuff. No, see, he doesn't want anybody sitting in the front because he's got a feeling someone's going to mess with his stuff. Look, all my stuff's going to stay in the passenger side and all your stuff's going to stay with you guys in the back. All right? Cool. Nobody's going to mess with your stuff. No, I'm not taking any chances with you guys. Okay, now I'm confused. What did we do? Last Sunday when you guys came over for the game, one of you idiots stole my limited edition Blu-ray of Titanic, so <laughs> all shotgun privileges are lost. I don't have it. I don't. Limited edition. No, no, no. Who did it? Because I, I, my mother would really like it back. I didn't take it. I didn't take I it. I hate Titanic. And that's just an example. <laughs> you guys have stole so many other of my Blu-rays, and I don't appreciate it. Okay, so just, just forget about shotgun. Whatever, man. Okay. Well, I'm sitting shotgun.
What is it, Steve? Am, am I talking to myself here? What did I just fucking say? Well, we could either argue about this, or you could let me sit. Fine. Fine. Whatever. No fucking way. You're gonna let him get what he wants? I thought you had him, Rich. Whatever, man. Yeah, well, sometimes you don't always get what you want. Ain't that right, Nick? Yo, Steve-o! Hey, where are you going, huh? Keep running your mouth. What are you gonna do with my stuff, Nick? Come on, put it back. Uh, suck my balls. I'm so fucking done. Dude, look at that. Yo, Rich. Want a beer? Yeah, give me. Wait, you're taking pics? Yeah. Okay, let me get one. Let me get another one. Come on, man. Why you always got pose like that? Don't start with me. Hey, let me get another. Stand still. This is the type of shit you guys always do. Can never just enjoy the moment. Do you want to get in the picture? I is that it? Just do me a favor and take the picture, all right? OK. I am. Here, Janet, let's take a picture together. Come on, I'm gonna hit the full landscape. Okay. Yeah, it'll be nice for our relationship status. Here, my Facebook. buddy. Dude, why are you always trying to be so artsy for? I take dope pics, okay? <laughs> yeah. You should look at this one I just took. Selfies. Hey, I got mad likes. Hey, look, look at me, I'm Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck yeah. Yo, Steve. Oh, Dude, Steve, you wanna, you wanna... <laughs> hey, you shit on me, but it works. At least I'm not always taking pictures of my dog. Oh, yeah, it's either that or your girlfriend. <laughs> okay, why is that bad? We know what she looks like. We also know what you look like. Yeah, so. handsome. You know what? Don't talk. Because you delete pictures if you don't get enough likes on them. First of all, you're awfully aggressive. And second of all, I've only done that like three times. <laughs> Nick, you've you done did it, it yesterday. Too. Nick all has right, done it so many times. Not as many times as he has. This, that was back in the olden days when Instagram wasn't that crazy. Back in the olden days. Back in the olden days. I was a veteran of Instagram. I think I got all you guys on it. For sure. Whatever. <laughs> Yo, you know who gets mad likes? Emily Own. Emily Own, man. Yo, fucking Emily Own. I swear to God, every time I go on Instagram, she could post a picture of anything. It could be, you got it up? It could be a picture of her dog or roadkill. I swear to God, the girl gets all the likes. Dude, who cares? She's hot. Yeah, that's right. Can I have my phone? Yo, she posted a picture of her grandmother at her wake. You know how many likes? You know how many likes? I don't know. Like 60? Yeah, I'd say the same. 108. 108? <laughs> 108. <laughs> it's tragic. Of a dead I don't want to see it. I Dude, don't it's tragic. Oh my god. I don't want to see a dead person. Her dead grandma. I don't want to see a dead person. <laughs> Straight up saw a corpse today. Oh, that's horrible. Look how the clouds cover the land like that. It's called a shadow. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> I remember it was uh, Sean and I, Cassidy, Bobby, Lewis, and Claudia. <laughs> Claudia. <laughs> you know, she, Claudia was like the heavy girl. You know, she had a, a round nose, sinus problem, wore glasses, didn't talk to anybody in the class. 
didn't talk to anyone for that matter at all. <sighs> My parents actually uh, became pretty good friends with her parents. Her dad owned uh, like the local pizzeria, Lugio Slices, named after his, his grandpa. You know, it's a family business. It was good. It was like the go-to place for my dad. So that's how they became friends. And my mom and her mom started shopping together, which I obviously got the hint that I was going to be hanging out with Claudia pretty soon. You know, she was over my house all the time. So I figured, you know, like, what am I going to do? Like, ignore her? Like, She's in my living room, like, all alone, so. You know, we played games together. We both like Battleship and stuff. You know, one day, actually, on the, on the playground, everyone was at the swings. And uh, I was on the monkey bars with Sean and three of my other friends. And I was eyeing Melissa Alvarez. She was cute, you know, I had the biggest crush on her. And uh, then Claudia just shows up in front of me. And I didn't want anybody to know we were, we were friends outside of school. Like, I, couldn't, I could not let anybody find that out, you know. And now she's just standing in front of me, looking at me, blocking my view of Melissa. And... She just, she's just like, Nick, let's go to the swings. And I was like, I was like, no, nah, I, I, no. She's like, come on, let's go. I was like, what are, like, giving her this look, like, what are you doing? Like, come on, like. And I, I think she thinks I was acting like that because, like, secretly, like, deep down, I liked her. Like, that kind of thing. And then she grabs my hand and she kind of tugs me a little bit and asks, asks me again to come to the swings and I, I snapped. I just, I screamed in her face. I said, get away from me, fat ass. You're gross and I'm not your friend. I said that to her in front of everyone. You know, I see her and She's looking back at me. Melissa's still swinging and Claudia just walks away. I didn't even think about what I just said to her. She stopped coming over after that. <laughs> you know, I didn't see her. You know, sixth grade, we ended up going to different schools and Seventh grade, I found out her mom died from brain damage. You know, then uh, over the summer, I moved to Valley Stream. I didn't see her for like six years. That was the first time I thought about her. One month ago, I was at the the Yankee game and during the third inning I went to go use the bathroom and uh, as I was walking up I heard uh, I heard my name being called and as I turned around it was Claudia and her brother and I immediately knew it was her because she had the glasses and the round nose but she looked beautiful And, you know, we spoke for like five minutes. I could tell she didn't really want to talk, but she was happy to see me and I was happy to see her. To be honest, man, 
I feel good. I feel really good. I just don't understand why we weren't out here sooner. Yeah. You never have to think about shit, you know? Yeah. Yeah. Aaron's cool and all. Been hit me up. I realized. I don't really know her. Like, know her. Know her. You know? It's. I don't know, it's whatever. Aaron Rodgers. I mean, at least you're having fun. Does it really matter? Uh, what if I threw like this? Nah, not really. Like, like a crab yeah. man? Like this? Yeah, you look like a crab. You know, Nick? Fuck girls. <laughs> yeah, fuck girls. Shit. What? I got a fucking nude. A nude? Yeah. Wait, a n uh, let me see. No. Uh, what happened to fuck girls? Come on, it's a nude, dude. All right, then let me see. No, get away. Come on. Let no, me see. back off. Come on. <laughs> Yo! Guys! Hey, Steve got a nude! Got a nude? Yeah, a, a nude. He got a nude in the middle of. How'd you? How do you even get reception ooh, out here? Ooh, fucking really, ooh, dude? Who? 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 Don't worry about it. It's Aaron. Is it Aaron? He's no. Full who of is shit. it? Dude, I ain't full of shit. Who is it then? Who is it? Yeah, yeah. Stop, ooh, and I'll ooh. tell you. Carapace. Let me see. You have to. You have to. No, no, no. You have to. Who no, no, no. is no, no. it? Just no, no, no. no, no. fuck you up. I haven't seen good tits in so long. Ah. He's just trying to get with Julie. Why? You trying to fuck? I'm <laughs> just asking. <laughs> well, I mean, she's here. I mean, you should just ask her. Aren't you both friends anyway? <sighs> what am I gonna do? Go over and be like, hey, Julie, did you fuck Wilson? Exactly. Did you do that? Exactly, you should do that. No, I'm just kidding. No, just no. just casually ask her. No, I'm not I'm not asking her. But you you wanna know though, right? You wanna know something, that's why you asked me. But you won't ask. You know what? Fuck it. I'll ask her because I'm friends no, 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 with her. No, 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 Sebastian, what the Julie! Fuck? No, no, don't do that, don't do that. Yo, is she yo, where's Julie? Sebastian. Julie Sebastian. Sebastian. Come on, man, relax. Just, just, just ask her, just her, her, man. Just, just, oh, yo, it's good. It's good, man. How you What's feeling, bro? Good, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ow. What's up, Wilson? Yo, thanks for sharing, bro. Oh, no problem. What's going on? So, you fucked Julie? <laughs> no, I didn't. She's a bitch. I'm over it. What? What? Why do you, what did she do? Nah, dude, she was like, so we started like talking all the time. And then she started like texting me a lot. And then she started calling me like honey and like sweetie. And then like she wanted me like going to fucking picnic with her parents. And that was like, that was the last straw. I was like, I, I saw where it was going. I was like, nah, dude, that's fucking weird. Yeah, I'm not trying to do that. She sucks. But that ass though, man. I know, right? <laughs> <laughs> Come on. <laughs> <laughs> nah, she sucks.
You think you're gonna make friends like us in school? I don't know. Why? I, I don't know. I'm just wondering. Well, I'd be pretty bummed if I didn't make any friends. But I'm sure I'll meet some idiots like us that I can be friends with. Idiots like us? We're idiots. That's a good point. That's a good point. We'll see. I get this weird feeling. There's too much happening. There's too much that's already happened and there's going to be too much ahead. And I just feel like I'm stuck in the middle of it all. Yeah. I, th I think we all feel that way. Yeah. Maybe. Come on, man. Picks? How come it's always picks with you? It's looking real good. Man, that is a nice pick. <laughs> Weird. We're the kings of the world! <laughs> My voice cracked a little bit. <laughs> Look, you gotta say something like, I got this. <clears throat> I love big titties! Is that you? Oh shit, it is you. Okay, hey. Yo, what's good, man? How you doing? Good, man. Just came out of work, man. I'm bust. Yo, I actually, it's a coincidence. I, I heard that you and Ellis got into a fight yesterday at the line. He fucked you up. <laughs> nah, that didn't happen, man. Nah, you didn't fight him? Didn't happen? Nah, it was nothing. I don't know. Dylan told me that you guys, you know, you guys were fighting the line. He fucked you up. He said he uppercut you and some shit. I don't know, I think that's fucking nuts because I was like, they told me and I was just thinking like, wait, fucking Steve? <laughs> like, Steve got fucked up by Ellis. Yo, Ellis is half my size. I don't <laughs> believe that shit. Yeah, right, dude? Kid's a pussy, you know? Yeah, well, everyone says that he fucked you up. <laughs> you know, not just Dylan, I don't know a lot of people were telling me. Like, too. I wasn't there, but. Yeah, it's, it's like I told you, dude, it was nothing. <sighs> yeah, but he like, well, he got you, right? Uh, I mean, you got I see it. You got a fucking bruise right there. Come on. Hey, man. Well, why he fight you? Why? What was? Oh, okay. I don't know why. Cause, fucking uh. You've been talking to Abby, haven't you? Hey, you were talking to Abby. No, f <laughs> I knew it. I knew, everyone knew it though. That was you guys weren't low key about that. That's so fucked, man. Because I don't know. I was just a small guy, but I guess he's really protective. So you learn something new every day, right? Yeah. Okay, are you gonna like get him back or what? What? I'm saying are you gotta fight him, like you gotta get him back. Like, everyone knows so you can't you can't fucking leave it. You just gonna leave, leave it like that? Nah dude. Yo, I heard about this place. Yeah. My brother said it was built on ancient Indian burial grounds. Oh, no, oh okay. yeah, I heard about that. Comeback. The Swaggle oh, Indians, right? Yeah. Listen. Yeah. Stop scaring Danny. Let's just raise our hands and see who wants to go in, okay? All right, let's now go. I have both hands in the air, like an idiot.
Oh, shit. What? Two Gun Kid. That's so dope. You actually know Two Gun Kid? Yeah, of course. Are you okay? Uh, yeah, I'm good. I'm just, sure? I'm just really tired. Okay. You know. What's wrong? Um, I just work is stressful. You know, my dad is just, I don't know. He's always, uh, what is it called? Like he's always kind of nagging me, and and it's over the dumbest shit. Today I was in a rush to to, to work, and I parked across the street, and I didn't read the sign that says no parking ten to four. So he, he runs in and he goes, do you know how to read, blah, blah, blah. And I was like, yeah, I do. And I don't know. I was like, okay, I'll just move the car. And he's like, well, it's past four now, so it's fine. And I was like, you know, like, you don't have to be like, you don't gotta be so disrespectful, you know, especially in front of like the other people who work there. Kind of just makes me feel shitty, so I don't know. Well, you like, should smile now, because you're with me. Lauren? Come I on. know what you're gonna do, Come on. Lauren. I'm so smile. ticklish. Please, I'm gonna, I want to see you smile. Okay, I'll, you want me to smile? Yeah, okay. you're so cute when you smile. Okay, I'll smile, Lauren. Please, I'm smile. So I'm so ticklish. I'm gonna I fart, know. Lauren. I'm gonna fart. <laughs> no, you're listen, not. listen, listen, listen. I'll smile. I'll smile. Okay. Look, you ready for it? Mm-hmm. You ready? Mm-hmm. Are you kidding? Was, yeah. Look. That was not. As, that was good. I did, that it, was I did it twice, Lauren. I did it twice. You smile so much cuter please, when I tickle please. you, okay, and it's real. All right, okay, you have fire. Okay, it's good. It's good. You you got this. You got the. That wasn't even. Okay, <laughs> Lauren. Yeah. Okay, good. Good. You win. You got me to smile. I feel so much better now. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> Thanks. Lauren. Fine. Thank you. Oh. Did I tell you what my brother got me? No, no you didn't. He got me this amazing vinyl. Mm -hmm. He got me the American football vinyl, the new one. Oh yeah, you've uh, you've played them for me before, right? They're awesome, yes uh -huh. I have. I've played them for you so many times. Mm -hmm. Oh my God. They're actually, they're having a concert in the spring and I think we should go. Yeah. Yeah, it's in the city. Terminal 5, it's gonna be awesome. I mean, I've like kind of been saving the new vinyl so I only played the first track, but what I heard was awesome hmm. and they're so good live I went to their concert like three years ago and I don't want to say it was like a spiritual experience but it was like I was like so like connected you mm -hmm. know like yeah I don't know it just like wasn't ordinary it was fucking incredible Ray are you listening to me no I'm, I'm sorry I just responded to the text really quick so what did I say um, you said that you wanted to go to the, the, the concert, uh, in Terminal 5. After that? Um, you said that you, you love me and you want to go with me. Wow. To the concert. Mm. Uh, Lauren, please stop. I know this is, like, I know where this is Who are you is texting gonna... that's more important than me? It's, it's not that it's important, it's just, Steve texted me, so I just, I just wanted to respond. Wow. Okay. What's, what do you mean, wow? Lauren, I don't get what wow means. I was talking to you, but we were having a conversation. 
Yeah, and I just quickly picked like that's you know that's it's something that people do. They pick up phones really quickly to respond to a text, and then I was I was listening to you. Okay. You, I, I mean, just be. Just never mind. So you you don't think that you're being really fucking petty right now? Like you don't think I'm being petty? You're being really really petty. I'm right not now. being petty. Okay. Tell me, tell okay, me this fine. isn't you petty. No, 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 tell I'm me actually, this isn't petty, I'm texting Lauren. right now. Lauren, exactly, you're texting right now. So can now. you just not talk because I'm texting? So you're you getting, just shut okay, up. So can you shut the fuck up? I'm texting. Yo, why, why do you have to be such a fucking bitch? Whoa. Yeah, I'm serious. Okay. Every single time I, every single time I pick up my phone, Lauren, every time, every time I pick up my phone, you're like, oh, you don't, you don't pay attention to me, blah, blah, blah. And it's like, I don't understand. Like, I don't get it. Whatever, I don't want to fight for your attention. Like, that's fucking okay, stupid. Okay, I told I you I had a bad day, and then anymore. you're gonna, you're gonna like, you're gonna do this now. What is you having a bad day have anything to do with that? I listened to your whole story about your dad or whatever. All right, and I just responded to whatever, the text I'm message. I'm so over this. All right, great. So just walk away, Lauren. That's very mature. Lauren. Yo. How do you do it, Steve? With girls, I mean, like with Kara Patty, sending you nudes and all. How do you do that? She's still hot. You're lucky. Dude, honestly, it's really simple, right? So you just got text her, yo, you got some nudes? Then she texts back, yeah, I got some nudes. <laughs> and then you text her, all right, send me them nudes. Then she sends you the nudes. No, that's too easy. I don't believe that. <laughs> yeah, I call bullshit. Well, like, you know, that's just the general idea of the conversation. You gotta, you can't be a pussy. You gotta go for what you want. That's pretty damn vague. You wanna know what he does? Let me tell you what he does. The kid stays up all night, slides into all these girls' DMs, and he's fishing for them. So one of them responds, and then he schmoozes Dude, his way. Dude, that's bullshit, man. All right? I don't talk to a lot of girls. It's just when an opportunity comes, you go for it. I've slept over and actually seen you do that, so. <laughs> <laughs> Look, you're just overthinking it, all right? You gotta drop some lines Actually, on them. You're the Cause... one who's overthinking it, buddy. No, that's you, all right? All you gotta do is talk nice to them, you know? And then when they talk back, you respond to them with a little bit of that charm. You know, you be cool about it. You just can't be aggressive. If you go that route, it gets weird for you and her. Don't, don't take advice from this guy. Hey, who gets laid more, huh? This guy who's had a girlfriend for three years, or me who's been doing his own thing? I've been slaying poons since the seventh grade. <laughs> well, actually, Steve, since I have a girlfriend, I'm the one who's actually getting laid. Oh. That's true, Steve. Gotcha. Uh, it's a numbers game. Shut the fuck up. I don't know, guys. I mean, I'd want to have a relationship with a girl, but just, you know, just to see what all the fuss is about. Trust me, it ain't special. I mean, just to have somebody is all I'm saying. Yeah, it'd be nice to have a girl that you talk to that, you know, actually feels the same way about you. You're gonna meet a girl who's gonna think every weird thing you do is actually really cute, believe it or not. I'm not weird. Dude, That's not what I meant. you man, you're weird as hell. Besides, it don't matter. In college, there'll be plenty of girls who give it away for nothing. That's a matter of fact. Yeah, hopefully I'll meet someone in my major. Yeah, you're uh, doing economics, right? No, I, I changed it a while back. To what? I didn't tell you guys. No, what are you doing now? Bakery science. Bakery science? That's legit? I, I haven't heard of that before. Yeah, um, sorry, it's, got, it's called commercial baking. It's how to run like a good bakery. <laughs> you're kidding, right? You're not serious. Oh, yeah, commercial baking. That's what's up, man. Good for you. Yeah, thanks, brother. Yeah. Wait, so, uh, so you're doing like easy bake? Uh, don't be an asshole. No, I'm, let the kid talk. No, no, I'm just curious, okay? Just, just, just tell me, right? You're not messing with an easy bake oven, are you? What? <laughs> Shut the fuck up, Nick. Don't listen to him, okay? Nick, hey, uh, you gonna bake me some treats or what? Of course, dude. I'll cook for you. <laughs> let me ask you a question. What, what, what are you doing? Marketing? Yeah. And I'm a big marketing executive, I'm a muffin man over here. You could bake me some cupcakes. Wow, really? Really? Wow. Yeah. You're a real fucking hot shot, Steve. Look, I'm not saying I'm gonna be a hot shot. I'm just implying what would happen. You know, right. what does it even matter what we're going to school for? Dude, you're going to bake. So whatever, I can do whatever I want. 
Why don't you go make some fucking Betty Crocker then? It's Come on, science, hey, asshole. Don't let him talk to you that way. Stand up for yourself for once, man. I don't have to, all right? I don't care. See, I'm like you guys. I, I don't have problems I have to announce. See, he gets it. I'm like you guys who are acting like little bitches. Nick knows how to take a joke. Besides, the only reason why you're being so pissy is because things are actually working out for me. Let's, let's relax, all right, everybody? What's, what the fuck is the matter with you? Why are you coming at me like that? Come on, man, just listen to me. Listen. Don't, all right. don't tell me to listen, all right? Dude, fucking relax, okay? Just because you can't afford to go to a real college doesn't mean you have to be all fucking okay. pissy. Okay, okay, hey, you're, you're being a real dick right now, okay? So why don't you just shut up and we'll move on. Do you really want to come at me right now, man? Because I could talk a lot about you right here. Yeah? Go ahead. What are you gonna say, huh? This guy doesn't even know what he's doing at school. You picked off some typical major, so congratulations. <laughs> you think I care? I'm going to a fucking party school. You think you could pick up girls at some art school? I can't even get over Julie. Anytime one of us tries to hook you up with another girl or her, you never cease to fuck it up. So don't even come in my face right now, okay? Watch your fucking mouth, dude. Come on, man. Just shut the fuck up, Rich. Come on. You shut the fuck up. Why don't you tell me to shut the fuck up again? Okay, I fucking okay. okay. All right, shut all right. the fuck up. Yo, hey, stop. hey, stop! Get, get, what the fuck are you doing? No, what the no, fuck are you doing? Fuck fuck off me. Me. Fucking bitch, don't shut fucking hear the fuck up. Rich, Rich. Oh. come on. Hey. You're all fucking soft, hey. Steve. Hey. You're all don't fucking soft. Go ahead. Don't fucking touch him. Go Steve. Hit me. Don't fucking touch him. Don't fucking touch him. Stop, man. Steve, stop. Stop. For a fucking second there, Steve. For a fucking second there, Steve. I thought you were my fucking boy. Stop. Fucking go. Fuck you, dude. Get out of here. Fuck you guys. Fuck you! What the fuck did I do? Fuck! Rich. Rich, can you talk to me? And fuck Steve. He's such a fucking asshole sometimes. And fucking Nick too. Kid can never say enough for himself. Fuck Steve. Always gotta bring up personal shit. I can't go to college, so what? Marketing major. Kid is so full of himself. Fuck that. Rich, they're our friends. I know. I know. His opinion doesn't matter though. It means nothing. So forget about him. What does he know? Call that shit that he said about Julie. You think that was oh true? Oh my what he God! Said about me? Again with Julie? You see what? You see where I am right now? You see what I'm fucking going through? Danny, you fucking see what I'm going through? I fucking like her. Okay. So then do something about it. Because you're always going on and on about Julie. Julie this. Julie that. Just pick up your phone and text her. That's all you have to do. It's not as easy as that. I call her. But it is as easy as that. Because then, this is what you do. You're like, I have to text Julie. And then, and then you don't, and then you go on and on about it all day. I want to have other conversations besides Julie. Okay, I'm, you guys are leaving. Okay, you guys are leaving. I'm tired of hearing her name. You're right, we're fucking leaving, so I'm sorry I came to you for fucking advice, Rich. Oh, it's fine, but... And I'm giving you my advice, but just take it. Okay, take my advice. Text her. What are you scared of? I'm not fucking scared! I just don't know what to say to her. You, you can say hi, you can say what's up. You got a fucking girlfriend, you don't fucking know. It's not as easy for me. How, I mean, how, how could you know if things would ever work out with her if you don't talk to her? If she doesn't answer you, she doesn't answer you. So what? Okay, that's it. There are so many other girls out there. Fuck, okay, man. Just, just talk to her. So then you and I can, can stop talking about it. Because I'm over this conversation, Danny. I'm over it. Okay? I just, I just need a minute. Okay, I just want to sit down.
Hello? Hey, it's Danny. Yeah, I know. Hey. Hey. Uh, what's up? Nothing. Um, I'm actually upstate right now. Hello? No, no, I'm with uh, Rich and Steve and Nick. Oh, sounds fun. Yeah. So, um, I was just thinking about, uh, the party bus. <laughs> Is that why you're calling me, Danny? No, no, no. Um, I just, we never talked about it. Uh, that was fun, right? Um, yeah. It was, uh, it's also really embarrassing. Was that embarrassing? Did I embarrass you? No, 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 no. Um, it was just that everyone was watching us. But it was fun. It was a good time. I think you kissed me first. Yeah, I did. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, that was, that was fun. Yeah, it was. Okay, cool. Great. Uh, I mean, for me too. Uh, uh, okay, uh, awesome. Uh, that's kind of why I wanted to talk. That's why I wanted to talk to you. About? About us? Okay, um... What about us? I really like you. Do you really like me? Yeah, and um... I don't really know how to go about this. Talk to a girl the way a guy is supposed to talk to her in this. <laughs> Look, I just don't want you to think that I don't have feelings for you because I do. I think about you a lot, okay? And maybe now isn't the best time to say this with us going back to school and all. Um, you know, Actually, no. This is a good time, because if I don't say this now, then I probably no, never will. I mean, it's actually not the best time for something like this. Well, I don't I, know uh... how I feel right now. So, I guess we both don't know. How you feel about me? Yeah. No, no. I'm. I don't know. It's just like I mean. When we talk to each other, it's like one of us is just trying to say the right words, and I know it's you, and I'm just waiting to hear it. But it took too long. You know, be funny seeing everybody at our high school reunion. Mm. I want to see everybody I fucking hated, but really fat. <laughs> like, like Bart Riker. <laughs> Jeez, that's fucking nuts. Dude, I you, want... You okay, Nikki? You, you want to talk about it? He was a dick. <laughs> <laughs> he was a damn, yo. What the fuck is the matter with this kid? <laughs> I'm John Lovitz. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> you think any of us will be married by then? Yeah, maybe. I could see you being married first. 100%. 100%. What makes you say that? Oh, you know, I could just see it. You come in, your wife, super hot, huge tits, nice ass, and everyone's just thinking to themselves, how did he do it? You know? <laughs> That'd be nice. I want to marry a Frenchie. You know, my cousin Val went to France. He told me they do it all. Yeah. You know what I'm fucking talking about? Like, Steve with a Frenchie? A brunette Frenchie? I mm -hmm. can see that. British girls. I'd go for a British girl. British girls, oh my god, yes. They're sexy. Mm. Uh, like, I I've seen ugly British girls and they're still hot. Imagine me with a, with a British wife. Hello, Richie. <laughs> How about a blowjob? <laughs> I don't know why, don't know why her voice would be so deep. Hello, Yo, Richie. If you marry a British chick, I'm definitely with a French girl. Yeah, right. Steve's gonna be with a French girl because uh, French girls don't speak English, so they won't know whether you're an idiot or just a cute American. Yeah. Yeah. Dude, I'll take that as a fucking compliment, man. I'll get to fucking marry her and I don't have to charm her. Fucking thanks, dude. <laughs> I'll take that. You ever had like, like the ideal girl of your dreams? What, like a like a girl you fantasize about? Yeah, like if I was ever to marry anybody, like I'd marry like Madonna. <laughs> She's a Madonna. <dumb. laughs> okay. Dude, real talk though, right. fucking Madonna. Yeah. <clears throat> Fuck yeah, dude. Don't. Don't ever do that again. <laughs> <Don't> do that again. <laughs> Rich is definitely gonna marry Lauren. Dude, that's just a matter of fact. I don't know. You guys have been together all throughout high school. That's like 20 years right there. Yeah. You get married. Another 50 years of marital bliss. All right, stop, all right? We'll, we'll see. I'm calling it. <laughs> but it would be pretty crazy if you did marry her. You want to marry Madonna, and it's pretty crazy that I marry my girlfriend? <laughs> okay, like Madonna <laughs> in her prime, okay? Not like now. All right, Makes yeah. even less sense. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. Dude, fuck it. You three guys are going to be the best men at my wedding. Fucking, we'll have this sick bachelor party. We'll be so fucked up, we won't even remember it. That sounds... That sounds really good, man. Best man at my wedding. Me too. Me too. Actually, fuck you, Nick. You could be the flower girl. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> 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 They're sleeping? They're knocked. They're still drinking those? Probably warm by now. At this point, it doesn't taste like anything. Listen, Rich. I've been thinking. Things didn't go the way I hoped with Julie on the phone. But she didn't seem like she didn't want anything to do with me, so I kind of feel like I still have a chance, you know? I feel almost certain that when we get back, I can see her and I can sell it to her that things might work. What do you think? I'm not sure, but... I have a feeling that it might work. Stop. 
What? I can probably draft her on weekends. When are you gonna give it a break? You guys aren't even dating, man. You want to know something? I don't know what's going to happen with me and Lauren. I got a feeling we're going to call it quits. Since she's going to school and I'm staying home. <laughs> How do you know that? You can't just stay together? I could just tell. She was acting weird the last time I saw her. And we're gonna meet up tomorrow and I, I just know it. It's long distance, man. You, you think it's gonna work? Yeah, it's not gonna work. Whatever, I mean, I was, it was just high school anyway, but, but it just sucks, you know? When I was a kid, I heard my dad talking to my mom, and I wasn't supposed to be listening, but yeah, he kept saying how where he ended up, it wasn't according to his plan, and he had a plan, and he was going to be something. got married too young and then he had me after her and he had to get a job that he hated and he just kept talking about how he hated his life and I promised myself I said I'm not I'm never gonna be like my dad I'm never gonna live a life of regret like he did I thought, I thought by now I'd, I'd have everything together. I'd know what I want to do. I'd go away to college. I just don't know anymore, you know? I just don't want to be like 50 years old. I just hate my life, you know? Sometimes I just, I just wish he'd, he'd sit down and have a beer and just look around and, and say, you know what, my life sucks, but so what? He's bored. And I never want to be like that. I never want to be like that. And I'm so scared, Danny. I'm so scared that I'm gonna, that I'm gonna regret things too. I'm, gonna, I'm scared things are never gonna be the same with us. And, I, and I'm scared that Lauren's gonna go and she's gonna meet some guy who's doing the same things as her, who's better looking, who's funnier. And that she's going to forget about me. And that all you guys are going to forget about me. And that the neighborhood is never going to be the same. You don't need to go to college. You don't need to go anywhere for things to work out. I know you're gonna be okay.
Rich. I'm really happy that I'm here with you. Up. Morning. Nick, get up. I want to go home. Let's go home. A question. Have you ever seen a doctor for your feet? Why? Why? <laughs> Hold on. Last night, you, you, you walk in, and there was this terrible odor with you, okay? You take your socks off, all right? And one by one, he perfectly places them right next to his pillow, right? And all fucking night, I stayed up. I couldn't even wake you up, because I don't want to touch him. It's terrible. Fuck you. Shut up. It was terrible. Shut up. You, you, you should seriously see a doctor. I did see a doctor. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, my God. I have a serious, I have a serious, I have a serious foot problem. And I, honestly, I wish I could control the odor. I wish I could control the way that that feels. But I, I spray and I spray. I'm telling you. Spend, Daddy. Daddy. <laughs> Fuck your fuck, feet, Fuck bro. you. Fuck, fuck your feet. Fuck you. Guys, stop being fucking idiots. This is like children here. Yo, do you guys remember the time Danny got suspended for telling Miss Nevin to shake her ass? <laughs> I didn't tell her to shake her ass. <laughs> What'd you say? I don't remember. We don't forget something like that. I told her. Shake it for Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's what he said. What a fucking idiot. I bet you Steve dared you to do it. No, I did it off of my own volition, but I... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> what? I, he doesn't control me, and you know what? I regret it. I regret it, honestly. I don't know why I did it. Yeah, it's because you didn't give a shit during a yoga session, too. <laughs> oh, man. Mm. She was so hot, though. You guys think, like, now that we're out, I got a chance with her? Like, Definitely. I'll just hit her up? Yeah, for sure. She's only, like, 38 years old. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> You guys forget she touched me during those session, sessions too. She touched everyone, dude. <laughs> yeah, but I I played like I didn't know what I was doing, so she had to like maneuver me and help me like get in the right position. No, she was my I was I was afraid. No, she, no, it's you just because you. That? It's just because you suck. You don't know. She, 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 she didn't touch you as much. She touched me. <laughs> Whatever. Just tell the police. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Yo, you know, you know. Uh, 
What about when we we, we, we were outside of the, the, the Chiba Thai place, right? When we were with Snowball. Oh, oh, <laughs> the lady comes outside and she's like, hey, knock it off. It's Steve Hawks and Snowball at her. <laughs> Yo, and that, it was, I just felt terrible. That was, and we ran away after that, too? Dude, I like a bunch of criminals. <laughs> you made it impossible for us to go back there. I feel so bad. Oh, <laughs> Senior Sunrise was crazy. Rich threw up over, all over his final. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you went home, right? But you had to take it a week later. Well, it gave me a week to study for that test, but... Yep. I threw up all over the test. That's Dude, nasty. even Miss Rosa was like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> I stunk. <laughs> that stunk? <laughs> he, he, he wants to get me back for his feet. He wants to get for his feet. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, was, I never drink like that again. It was, it was, that was bad. Yeah, well, at least that early. Yeah. <laughs> I had, the, I had my play the same day, so I, I mean, I was sobering up a little bit, but like, I still felt a little drunk. So I thought I almost threw up on stage. So yeah, you were that clock, fucking Coxworth. No, you idiot. <laughs> it's, it's Coxworth with a G. <laughs> You're pretty good. You're honestly not that bad in it, but the, the whole mustache thing was freaking me out. I liked it. I liked my costume. Yeah, I bet you did. <laughs> You guys remember that time uh, Steve asked out Abby Russo and she said no? Yo! Yeah, I do. I remember that. Yeah, and she went out with hanky lips at LG. She did! Oh, I was just on <laughs> Instagram Dude, the other day. Sophomore year. Relax. <laughs> hey, it's okay if you cried. I didn't cry. Shut the fuck up. That's oh, you. it's all right, Look, buddy. This Look, this is the guy that <laughs> she chose over Look Steve. Look at his hair! You guys got have the same hair. Steve. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Look at him. That's, well, that's your man, dude. I bet you were jealous of that. It, I wasn't. It doesn't even matter. I got with like two of her friends next week anyway, so. Oh. Oh. Who? Oh. Oh. Don't, oh. don't worry about it. What friends? Don't worry about it. Hanky fucking lips are 